Wow, this is a Harris Fest, Mexico 2017, and here we are with Das Ich de Fracama. Yeah, willkommen aus Mexico. Um, tell us, how, uh, I mean, uh, is this your first time for the Harris Fest or no? For Harris Fest, it's the second time in Mexico, we were the first time here in 97. Oh, yeah. that's so, great. Yeah. And uh, what time have you said you're going to play? 7.50 oh. and we are ready at 8.50. Oh, perfect. I, so. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, can you share re with your fans about uh, the music? How, I mean, how, when have you started with music? 1987. Oh my God, you and have a good memory. Nine, the first song for Das Ich. Yeah. Yeah, it was Gottes Tod, the first song. Yeah, the I find... Song was Keinen Abel. <laughs> okay, I find very unique your music. I mean, I have never heard any of your songs similar. I think that each yeah. song is a unique uh, masterpiece for me. Of course. Yeah, but uh, what are your influences for that? I mean, what is your creative process? Mainly, it's the life who's telling us the stories. For Bruno, I can't speak. You have asked himself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and for me, it's just looking around, see things, and get an idea of everything, and just trying to explain in my lyrics. Okay. Uh, do you remember what you used to listen to when you were a child? My first LP I was buying was behind the green door from, from Shake and Stevens. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it was young. <laughs> yeah. I didn't hear about gothic music in this time. No? No, no, no. Then I how... Was 13 how, or something like this. Yeah. Maybe 12. <laughs> and how have you started to listen to this music? It started in Bayreuth, in the city where I met Bruno, 87. A little bit before, I was in Kulmbach, a little city. And I was starting, beginning as punk, dancing in a circle, make pogo dancing. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that was the beginning. Okay. And of course, Bauhaus, Susie and the Benjis, okay. all these bands, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's great. And. Uh, no, I'm one no? Seven. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So, in the beginning, was it difficult to find, uh, I mean, to record and then find a label? And then to broadcast to the world? Of course. Yes. But this question is better for Bruno because he's a businessman and he can explain this much better. Than yeah. <laughs> everyone we made an offer said no. <gasps> in this time. No way. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so we did it on our own, but Bruno will explain this better. Oh, that's yeah. great. Yeah. Um, well, uh, have you arrived since the beginning of the fest, or are you arriving now? We arrived two days before. Oh, well, Yesterday, yeah. <laughs> we had sound check, and after that, no, before. Before, we was on this boat trip on the river. Great. Second time. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Okay. I, I try, or maybe it's possible to visit tomorrow once more again the Sun and the Moon Temple because I was there already in 97 with the lovely woman of the organizer from this time I don't remember the name I'm sorry <laughs> my brain is broken don't worry <laughs> yeah you 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 have you have a nice uh, you have, you can say this easy for me it's very hard because it hurts <laughs> Don't worry, you are uh, wonderful. <laughs> well, thank you so much for no, this. No. Enjoy uh, the show and yeah. keep going. And yeah. Sorry for the earthquake and all the people who were hurt by the earthquake or was dying by the earthquake, but I can't do something against. I can't help. I could if I could, but it's impossible. No, no, no. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Dankeschön. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.